morning students here i'll welcome you to our virtual class our today's topic is the diversity in the society that as before i have explained you what is mean by the diversity It means the very these kinds of people even you can see a, a variety you can see in the society so students in this picture you can see very well the people that in society uh, the people we can see the people who who speaks various languages the people who are living uh, various peoples of various religions cultures customs and tradition we have seen it so it means that this diversity this diversity is a mark of our rich cultural heritage yeah because see religion if hindu culture is different christian culture is different jain culture is different muslims culture is different but still we are living together that's why it is this india is a mark of the rich cultural heritage and in our india we speak different languages such as marathi kannada telugu urdu bengali hindi and gujarati such kind of language speak by people and along with that we celebrate the festivals also just now only we discussed ganpati veki festival is going on but the ganpati the um, worship of this idol a worship is done by the various kinds of people so it means we are celebrating our festivals and even cultural events also and in every religion the mode of worship is totally different see the mode of worship matlab uh, means that the how you are worshiping your god there are there various methods in jainism hindu muslims and christian and even our country which has a historical legacy yeah we have a historical legacy also that shared and celebrated just take the example this ganpati celebration uh, is started by the bal gangadhar tilak so which has a historical legacy okay so because of that this festival is celebrated by every people then all of this different communities in our country they live together for many years and feeling because we are living together so that the feeling of oneness leads to unity in indian society then diversity this diversity is our power is our strength to live with a different groups is a experience coexistence so students what is mean by the coexistence coexistence it helps to increase the level of understanding amongst the people if we are coexist if we are living together if we are living together definitely we are going to understand the people that level of understanding increase when it is increased when there is a coexistence so because of that what uh, this in this diversity we have accepted the other traditions customs and way of like take a example in maharashtra in the morning we love to prefer a south indian dishes matlab kisi ke ghar mein naashte mein idli banta hai kisi ke ghar mein agar function hota hai so they love to make biryani aur kabhi hum hotel mein jaate to basically hum order मोस्टली हम ऑर्डर पंजाबी फूड से करते छोले पनीर पनीर मसाला एंड नान सो इट मीन्स दैट वी हैव एक्सेप्टेड दैर कस्टम्स वी आर एक्सेप्टेड दैर ट्रेडिशन एंड इवन स्कूल में अगर तुम्हारा डांस कॉम्पिटिशन होता है तो इन दैट डांस कॉम्पिटिशन यू परफॉर्म अ कोली सॉन्ग यू परफॉर्म अ भांगरा यू परफॉर्म अ वेरियस काइंड ऑफ दिस ओके सो इट मीन्स दैट we have accepted their tradition and even we what help is this uh, this helps to increase the feeling of a unity in the society so we, what is the reason behind it it has the unity okay so this is a society uh, face many natural and social calamities together check the example of now this pandemic situation is going on 
this corona situation but the doctors police officers they are the part of the society they are coming together and they are fighting and they are protecting us various vaccination centers is available in our surrounding their people are coming they are vaccinated us it means that we the society we face various problems it has to face various natural and social calamities together the secularism what is meant by the secularism indian society consist of people of various religion so means uh, so that we cannot give the importance to only muslim religion we cannot give the importance to the jainism we cannot give most important only to the hindus so what the our constitution they made important provision that all communities will have a freedom of worship according to their faith and to help develop a feeling of mutual understanding so that's why uh, this our constitution gives the right that whether you are belonging from any religion you can worship as per your faith and help to develop feeling of mutual understanding and students india is a important sector secular nation in the world why it is important secular nation in the world that we can see a diversity of the religions and the linguistic but still peoples are living together so that is a secular nation in order to preserve this diversity in a very healthy manner the principle of secularism okay i mean secularism is principle is accepted so uh, student secularism secularism means what to preserve the diversity means all the community peoples they are living together and uh, uh, they uh, the constitution gives us right and uh, they can worship themselves and india uh, why we call it as a secular nation because in india we can see a various linguistic people and religious people living together so what is mean the mean by the principle of secularism that no religion is recognized as the religion of our country if you are living in india we are indian we are not hindu we are not christian we are not kannad we are not telugu we are not gujarati we are all are indian so that's why constitution said no religion is recognized as the religion of our country and every person they have a freedom of worship as per their religion and as per their choice there and even we cannot discriminate the people uh, on the basis of their religion all the religion people are tre treated equally by the state we cannot say that it is a, a gujarat state only gujarati people will stay it is a karna it's a maharashtra only marathi people said no we all are indian and our constitution said that we are not supposed to discriminate the people on the basis of their religion even the same uh, in our school we are not giving admission only to the christian christian students we are giving the admission to all the students na? so it means that opportunity to education and while appointing teacher our school is doesn't think that she is a hindu teacher she is a christian teacher so we will appoint only christian teacher no it means the opportunity of education gov jobs are made available to all and there is no discrimination on the basis of their religion and even there are minority what is mean by the minority minority means they are very less in number if the people they are very less in numbers we have to take care of it and we have to give the give them opportunity to develop themselves so there are some uh, there are some uh, pro provisions are made for this minority and my, so that student they this minorities are free to bring the development for their own communities through education and this principle of secularism helps to maintain 
religious harmony in indian society they maintain what they maintain religious harmony so the contribution of society for our development if you wanted to develop a society what is the uh, if you wanted to do the development what is the contribution of the society first is the cooperation if we are cooperating each other then only our society can develop we are ready to tolerate tolerate means we have to we have to ready to listen others and we have to understand and even society gives us opportunity to perform and your role in the society see students cooperation cooperation means what when all society when you see in this picture you can see it very well if all other these three people if he will help the fourth one then only he can survive and all together we can do a development is so so fast so that's why the existence of the society depends upon the cooperation between individual and even cooperation is the process of sharing and helping each other coexistence means what the level of understanding coexistence means level of understanding and cooperation means the process of sharing and helping each other and even check the example of our family in our family we are five members we are seven members we are four members if we have a cooperation if we are cooperate each other then only work can